Hi everybody, this is Danae and today I want to share more about the Conscious Collection with you. In particular, more about my masks, which was one of my favorite parts of my skincare routine. So many of you may or may not know how important good skincare is. Our skin is our largest organ and it takes 26 seconds for whatever we put in our skin to enter our bloodstream. So it's really important that we're providing our skin with skin food, food that's nourishing our um, skin and our insides too, which is how the Conscious Collection has really been inspired. So today I want to tell you more about the masks that I have. So to mask, I typically mask about once or twice a week, and this is to get deeper cleaning into the pores, to offer exfoliation, to um, really just deepen the whole skincare routine um, past what you do on a daily basis. And so I have four masks in my collection. I have Hydrate, which is made of roses and aloe vera and coconut milk, so it's very hydrating to the skin. I have a Radiant Mask, which is a honey-based mask that has turmeric and spirulina and lots of other yummy things in it. And it's really good for uh, brightening your skin. I have a Clarity Mask, which has calendula, which is marigold flowers, a little bit of clay and matcha tea. So it's really good for clarifying your skin and evening it out and smoothing it out too. And then the last one that I have is the Glow. It's a mask and a scrub. And I actually want to show you guys a little bit more about that one in particular today. So I love this because you can use it as a mask or a scrub. It has um, apricot kernel seeds, that's the exfoliate exfoliant in it, and then it has hibiscus flowers, so it's a beautiful hue of pink too. So a lot of these masks are a powder-based mask, and I made them a powder-based mask so that you can really customize your experiences with the mask. Because the truth is, is your skin is always changing and your needs might change too. So some days you might be a little bit more dry, while other days you need to brighten up your skin tone. And truthfully, we could even use our masks to section off our face in that way too. You might have more oil in a certain section and be a little bit drier in other areas of your skin. And so having a powder-based mask really allows you to customize your experience. And so some of the bases that I recommend using with these masks, we have a wide variety to choose from. So you could use apple cider vinegar. I mix that in here with the glow scrub here and it's beautiful and pink if you can see and it leaves your skin nice and pink too. I mix, uh, you really can play with the consistency. I either do it a one to one ratio, ratio or one to two, meaning one part mask to one part uh, liquid or whatever you're choosing as your base or one to two. So you can play with how thin you want the consistency. But apple cider vinegar in particular is going to help to prevent breakouts. It's also really cleansing too. It's detoxifying and it helps to balance the pH of your skin, which is super important. And then um, you could use egg whites, which would tone and tighten your skin. You can use yogurt, which I've used here that also acts as a gentle enzymatic exfoliant and it's very hydrating too. You could also use avocado. I like to use aloe vera when I'm soothing any um, inflame, inflammation in my skin. So lots of options to choose from. And like I said, you can customize your experience um, from time to time too. So I hope you guys all take a chance to have your own experience of deepening your skincare practice and adding a mask to your routine. And my products are now available on my website. That's DanaeFenty.com. So you can try these yourself too. And if you have any questions or you'd like to know more, you can email me at MissNutrish.com. Can't wait to hear how you enjoy them. Bye.